99. Turn it up. Now you've had an opportunity to check out the lineup. Now kicking it off on the air stage. Faithless, baby. Yeah.
Good DJ, very good night. Everybody's here from all over the world and it's great. All right, move over! All right, guys, we're getting closer and closer into the fire area, which is supposed to be the more kind of like chill out area, but by the sound of it, it's no chill out, I can tell you right now. But we have to sort of like go and see what the people, if they're really chilling out or not, because over there it's really mad. Oh, that's quite comfortable. <laughs> Sorry. That's all right. Make sure you're rolling. Yeah, we are. It's so exciting and it gets so many people together and we all want to do all the same things and it's just amazing. It's wild. It's fantastic. People say that the first year that you go anywhere is the best year. And for us, up until, to, up until tonight, up until it was. Tonight. But, I mean, it's just amazing. You can you can go and dance to David Morales in there. And if you get bored of that, look at it. If you get bored of that, you can go and see Faithy. In oh, mate, group. Faithless, I tell you, they did it, they did it big time, it was wicked. <laughs> come on, come on. Well, eventually we'll get there, don't worry, because I really want to check out... Oh, come on, growing up, come on, kids. They're like kids, you know, they see cameras, they're getting all silly. Yeah, well done, well done. It's everything here, there's garage, dance, hip-hop, you name everything here, the beer. <laughs> we are going to get some babes here, I can yeah. promise you. Babes all over the place. Babes are all over us. I'm all over us! And we're gonna take them! Yeah, yeah, yeah! yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Now what? Yeah, sure we do! They can't resist us! We thought about sweat! A bit of sweat! Right! How are you? Yeah, we're good, right? Very good! Yeah, very good, we like that! Alright! Ooh, funny hands, funny hands! Come on, come on, come on! Ooh, sorry! Funny hands! Hey, how are you? Fine! What? How are you? Fine! Where are you from? Here. Right oh, you're here. from Ibiza. Fantastic. Have a good time. I am. Everyone is having a good time. Great. I want to have a dance, so go away. I'll see you in a bit. Man, this is this is excellent. I mean, so many times we go to clubs, you don't get to see half the people playing. And when you get an event like this, it means you can get to hang out with some of the DJs. You know, it's it's nice. It's not, you know, there's American DJs, Spanish DJs, German, Italian. Man, this is 
this is like a real event. What can I say? The lineup, it seems like the cream to the cream of uh, what's going on right now in the 90s. And uh, to be considered one of them uh, is an honor in itself. It's a great lineup. You know, I mean, it gives people like myself a chance to go and check a few of the American DJs out. You got a few of the local DJs, which I think is really important. Um, you know, and you got great acts performing. I think it's a good show. I've been playing over 20 years. I've played for huge events, small events, and yes, I still get nervous. And yes, I am nervous. What do you think the audience is going to be like out there? It'd be interesting to find out when I step on stage, just everything's going to change. So my perception when I'm in the crowd is one thing. My perception when I get up behind those decks is a whole different thing. So until I step behind those decks, I don't even know what I'm in for yet. I love playing records. There's nothing, there's nothing as exhilarating as seeing an audience go mad. And when you know that there's 5,000 people out there for you, you can spit on the decks and they holler, oh, yes! Because they're there for you and you become one. And the feeling when you're playing a record and you want to sing to the record and you look at the people and you say, yes, yes, I love you, you're, you're the best. And, you know what I mean? People like that, you know what I mean? They feel the connection, you know? I think Ibiza, to me, is a place that is at the forefront of dance music. There's nowhere else in the world that you can come and see people like Paul Lokenfold, David Morales, Faithless, Norma J. Let's just say you put Glastonbury on a superb basis and this is what you got. Sod them back home, I tell you, you want to come over to this island and have it, because this is bloody brilliant. I've been playing over 20 years now. I'm a DJ from a different generation. My schooling, my education was two of the best clubs I was ever in the world, and that was a Paradise Garage and a Loft. And I think that my job, I feel, is to bring my experience to what I felt and pass that along. It's amazing, it's huge, it's like, oh my God, I can't believe it, I'm here, I'm here, finally here, I've saved up so much money, it's like, ah! It's a really good vibe, everyone's really happy and we're just looking forward to having a really big night. 
it'll go on, we'll party on into like tomorrow and the next day. We came especially to Ibiza so that we could be here for the MTV event. We booked our holiday and it's worth it so far. Brilliant. That is going to be excellent. Whoa, ho, 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 ho. That was Mr. David Morales rocking that New York style house. MTV doing a wickedy, wickedy, wickedy style, baby. Peace. MTV I beat the 1999. You'll never see anything like it. Creeds got the same needs and ignorance leads to pain, feeds the flame, international shame on a global scale. People living in hell, yo, watch that smell. I ain't talking about the poor, but the rich. You can have everything you want, and life can still be a bitch. Which just goes to show that if you don't let go of your ego, you never know what peace really means. All your dreams lose magic. Team, the devil was every day, the devil so deep. They only surface at night. Smile at you while you sleep. You just keep on. Now you can never rest. And like a big dark secret, keep it close to your chest because you wanna impress. Make moves, nothing less than the best will do. Don't care who you screw. I got the nerve to wonder what the world's coming to. Tonight, God is a DJ.
Church. First time I've said this, it won't be the last, but yeah, listen. This is our church directly. Yeah? This is not an exclusive church. This is an all-inclusive church that's everybody. Fantastic time, I believe. What a brilliant. My parents met out here. I was I was conceived in Ibiza, so yeah, I'm a big fan of Ibiza. The spirit and energy of the island is what really appeals to me. I and mean, this is my 13th year. Um, and you just keep coming back. We have the best clubs uh, to start, some of the best in the world. Uh, the weather is close to Europe, you know, everything together, you know, makes it special, you know. It's literally my second home and you know, you see many changes, but the spirit is still there and the energy just is incredible. Now you see, it's not just about DJs and bands. You've got all these mad people here doing juggling and they're so good. I have to say, I was a little bit worried setting. I was like, what happens if they lose it? Land straight on my head and then I'll be flat out. But it's just great, you know, the atmosphere is great. People are standing, looking, some people dancing. Brilliant. <laughs> California. California. You don't have an American accent. Thank you very much. <laughs> it's a compliment, huh? So, what is it all these people? Are you like traveling together or how does it work? They're friends of Kumharas. What is it? Explain. Kumharas, it's the generation of keeping the child inside of you and never becoming old. Ah, oh, it's cool. When you do a party and 5,000 people saying, Wah! to the flames, it's really cool. By fire, with fire. The audience has been amazing. It's, you know, pure hands in the air and clapping and going mad. It's a really, really nice crowd, actually. Really nice crowd. 1999 MTV Ibiza style. We're in the quarry with the mostest. Seb Fontaine has just tore it up, rocked the house. But right now, we got to pay some bills, yeah? So we're going to take a little break. And next, you know we got Mr. Frankie Knuckles. I've been looking for this for this for a long time now. I mean, I just got off a plane and I walked in here five minutes ago, you know, and just the energy level. When people turn, turned around and they saw me standing there, everyone just started screaming and I've never gone through anything like that before. <laughs> it's a one-off, it's a special one, you know what I mean? If you don't come here, you're gonna miss out on something amazing. So don't touch that dial. You think you've seen something? Well, you ain't seen nothing yet. Stay tuned for MTV I Beat the 90s. Well, 
Uh, I've seen the people. Is this scary or what? I mean, I don't know. I've seen them. Um, I mean, I did a quite early set, so I had a chance to see people coming in and start enjoying it, and it, and it became very busy. So that was very, very, very nice. And then after me, straight was Paul Ockenfull, which is still on at the moment and still is rocking. Set point in and Paul Ockenfull. Abiza! We got a loose party animal over here. Hey. Yo. Hey. What's up, baby man? Yo. It ain't over yet, baby. I know it ain't over. It ain't over. We got to tell them who we are. We got to tell them who we are. You ready, baby? Can we do one more song for y'all? One more, y'all? Yo. Can we do one more? Yo. Can we do one more? Let it drop, baby. Jungle Brothers, Jungle Brothers, Jungle Brothers, you know about this joint. Oh, 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 oh. It's from the love sound, love and support. We might... In general, you know, there was always the phenomenon of phenomena of like uh, the so-called holiday hit. I like the effect because a lot of times it has like taken uh, records from one culture into another culture. greatest hero in DJing was uh, DJ Africa Bombata and uh, uh, his basic motto always was uh, if you're a DJ why don't you challenge so I always try to challenge people I oh, don't try to follow completely what people know and what people like but try to challenge them and try to uh, broaden their minds about music in general open air, it kind of uh, can do more things than a lot of closed clubs. I don't know for what reason, because it's, you know, be probably because sky's the limit. Sky's the limit. didn't work. Uh, we've got three girls. Where are you from? Clone and Stuttgart. 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 And where are you from? I'm from London. Brazil. From France. From Brazil as well. The same same place. Yes. <laughs> Who did you enjoy the most? Jungle Brothers. All right, guys, make some noise. Oh! 
That was them, and that was me, boy. I just came here to have a really good time. Yeah. It's very nice. To be seen, that's what she came for. To seen and be seen? Woo -hoo. By whom? Everybody, that's as she said. Isn't that what beef is all about? Yeah, I agree. It's where are you from? Holland. Holland. Are you from? Yeah, I'm also from Holland. Excellent. So what do you think about this whole party? Yes, it's great, yes. Really, we are coming for this party. Sum up all Ibiza in one word, what would it be? Funky, spunky, disco monkey. <laughs> she said it. So how about all of you do a bit of a spin, because you got to see the whole outfit thing. Now, nah, baby. Oh, baby. Woo! Now, talking about the right bodies for a short, hot pants. That's what I say. Right on. So right now, you know what? Let's go check out Mr. Shit. Hey, baby. Hey.
happy for, you know, it's my home, it's not my hometown really, you know. Uh, yeah, terrific, it's been a great gig. I think everyone's been fantastic, you know, all, all the acts, and uh, it's really nice to uh, get that response, you know. So did it live up to expectation? Yeah, I think something's been a massive, massive gig. I mean, it's fantastic. Uh, I'll come again. <laughs> We're going to take a short, short little break. When we come back, we got Orbital and the Mad Nutters themselves, Alex P, Brandon Block. Don't move an inch.
And it was split between two stages. And so you had the more Latin thing going on on one stage and the more banging stuff going on the other. People split almost exactly in half, both stages full, top line up. Brilliant. Something like tonight where it's out in the open and it's like off the cuff, the idea, people are milling around, they've got lots of different things to do. I guess it's shown the clubs that they've got to keep up with the competition now and it's, uh, tonight's absolutely brilliant, absolutely fantastic. The South Hall. Well guys, as you can see, it's five o'clock in the morning, the bus is taking loads of fantastic people back home because they're all really tired, you know, it's really... Bye! Woo! It seems like they had a huge party, and so it seems. They're all smiling and happy. Yeah, we like that. So me, actually, I'm going to go back into the party, have a good dance, and start enjoying myself because I've been working until now, you know, so, uh, I'm off. Totally hedonistic, which is you know not, not necessarily about all the bad things that people say, but it's just a hedonistic place, which is great, yeah. and it's just natural. It's like you get education from it as well because it's uh, it, it takes away the ignorance of some things you wouldn't see normally back home because it's a lot conforms to sight. You've been around, you can see people really letting off steam here, and you, you can learn from that. Get off the plane here, for some reason you, you, you're overcome by this aura of the island, whatever it may be. I, you can't grasp it, it's like a, a spiritual, it could be a spiritual thing, it could be anything, but it's not like anywhere in the world. You can go anywhere and I promise you, you'll come back and you'll say, it's different. It's magic. Well, guys, it's five o'clock in the morning, and, uh, and uh, you want to be here? <laughs> do you know what I mean? Some people are really going for it, but I have to say, oh my God, no one even told me there is a tree. Thanks, guys. What's your seal? Um, yeah, no, no one even warned me. You know, I was about to knock myself out. So yeah, as I said, it's five o'clock in the morning. The party is still happening. I have to say, people are still going for it, but um, I'm kind of like tired. So I'm gonna be a good girl and go home to bed and have a nice shower. And, uh, you know, I just want to tell you that this party has been fantastic. Really, you know, I'm not just like, hey, pretending. It was really good, we had really good lineup, we had really good DJs, really good gigs. And just the people, you know, the atmosphere was so mad. And I think, if you ask me, this is the biggest Ayo, event Ayo, that I've ever seen in a long, long time. What are they like? My God. But you know what? It's all good. That's all for me. MTV, Ibiza, Balearic Islands. Let me tell you something. It's done it for me this time around, and I'm looking forward to the next one. But you know what? Before we go, let's take it back to orbital, baby. It's been lovely. See you later. Respect.